The pandemic has forced most of us to stay indoors, and that, of course, includes our children. Yeah, and with summer just a few months away, the city is already working on how to host its summer fun program safely. Kimberly Speakman reports. The city tells me this year's summer fun will look a bit like 2019 and 2020, with more cakey and group activities like before, but with COVID-19 precautions still in place. We're going to try to take the best from what we learned last year and apply it to this year. Um, again, because we don't know whether we're going to be in Tier 3 or Tier 4, we're planning for both contingencies. Last year, there were about six Kiki for every summer fun staff member. Under Tier 3, those groups will grow to 10. And if Oahu gets to Tier 4 by the time the program starts, that number will increase to 25. But the city says mask wearing, social distancing, and temperature checks will still be required. It will definitely look um, uh, easier and more relaxed than summer fun last year. But we had a lot of practice in um, keeping groups separated, having kids wear masks, having uh, hygiene and cleaning supplies that were available. So we would continue that. Another change from last year, the program will no longer be free. It'll cost you $25 to join, but there will be some financial aid opportunities. Some parents say the program can't come soon enough. It would give them a sense of normalcy. Most parents would agree that that would make them feel really good to know that their kids are in a safe place and that their kids are playing outside and interacting and just having that connection that, that we've lost over those so many months. Sheffield says she'd like to see changes to the online sign-up system. When it opened last year, she tells me she wasn't able to get in due to some glitches. Thielen says they're working with the Department of Information Technology to make sure the process runs smoothly. We're just going to try and figure out how can we do this better to be more um, adaptive, uh, but we are committed to having summer fun program. Kimberly Speakman, K2N2 News, working for Hawaii.